At midnight tonight, two more refineries will go on strike from the United Steelworkers Union. BP workers at refineries in Whiting, Indiana and Toledo, Ohio will join nine other refineries already on strike across the nation. Fox 4's Sarai Demine US, says USW members and their families are standing in solidarity today for what they say is a fight for workers' safety and health in the ExxonMobil in Beaumont. Not at this time, not right now. I'll just grab a sign. Yeah. Across the street from ExxonMobil's Beaumont refinery, USW union members and their families showed solidarity for a safer work environment. Uh, there are units out here that only have one man on them, and we'd like to see multiple men the way we know that they're safe. Safety measures that USW members also say includes reasonable working hours. So we want a fair contract that provides fatigue language to where our workers are not working. Absurd schedules like the 13 straight days with only one day off to recover. Gary Beavers says he wants oil companies to adopt a fatigue standard across the board. Look, we think the amount of days that the API 755 says is, is a reasonable amount of days. How much is that? Uh, it's 14 and off 36. 36 hours off would allow workers proper rest, according to Beavers, but that's just one issue concerning him. The heritage Exxon work and Shell work and Motiva work the work that's always been ours. It was never the intent of either one of the parties to attrit our people out of existence and bring contractors into the lower pay and less qualified. We're here as a family. Um, I don't think that the union is asking for too much. I think that they're worried about their, their self and others. Now they're standing united, fighting for what they believe is fair. We definitely hope to resolve this with a fair contract. Uh, for our 670 membership members. In Beaumont, I'm Sarai Demean, Fox 4 News. Workers at ExxonMobil are continuing to work on a 24-hour rolling basis. The company says the last and final offer will expire on February 15th. The possibility of a potential strike in the Beaumont area has drawn comments from people on our Facebook page. Jess Goodman wrote in part, unions have their place. Without them, who knows what kind of pay working conditions and safety standards would be in place. Eddie Vaughn says, I was on strike for three months. This is not the time for a strike. I think both sides should sit at the bargaining table until this is settled. No one ever wins a strike. Jessica Spillers Evans wrote, I just hope they come to an agreement soon. Follow us online and on air for updates.